All set with some smooth grooves, it's the Lees. Here's how it works. You and your family will guess the answers on the board to our survey questions. Whichever team gets the highest score goes on to play fast money for the chance to win 20,000 big ones. All right, let's get this show on the road. Hope you've got your game faces on, because it's time for a face-off. Who's going to join me up here? I need someone from each family. <laughs> Top four answers up on the board. When you have an answer to our survey, buzz in as fast as you can. Whoever finds the top answer first gets to decide if they want to play or pass. We asked 100 people to give us an answer to this. Name an occupation in which someone would have their hands insured. You got in first. Good answer. Answer accepted. Let's see if that's a good answer. Doctor. Perfecto. Are you going to play or are you going to pass? You think you can do this one? Okay. Got another answer? Nice. Is that one we've already had? Oh, dear. Oops. Guess what? We need an answer. Uh. Good. Said with confidence. Show me the answer. Chef. Uh. That's another strike. Oh. Name an occupation in which someone would have their hands insured. Oh, nice. All right, let's try it. Let's see if it's up there. Construction. And that's your third strike. Yay. Ho ho! Like my friend Al Capone used to say, our other family has a chance to steal. Yay. Sir, this family will steal the board. If your answer is on that board, you'll steal that money in the bank. Yeah, yeah. That's a good answer. Nice. Could it be there? Construction worker. No steal. And we got ourselves a winner. It's time to take a look at what we didn't find. The fourth answer. Athlete. Let's see number three. Musician. Number two, time to show yourself. Model. All right. Already blowing the roof off the studio. Oh, my. Oh, no. Get ready to go full Nick Cage, because it's time for the face-off. I need one person from each family to join me up front. You'll need seven answers. Buzz in first to answer. Get ready. We asked 100 people the following. Where do bodybuilders have muscles that ordinary people don't? You're first on the buzzer. What you got? Huh. 
great answer. We have an answer. What did our survey say? Jim. <laughs> Sorry, it's not up there. It's your go. What do you think? Where do bodybuilders have muscles that ordinary people don't? Good answer. Got it. Let's see if it's there. Face. Oh, too bad. The top answer is still up there. Think you've got it? Where do bodybuilders have muscles that ordinary people don't? Oh, nice. Ah, yes. Our survey said, arms. Top of the board. The decision is yours. Will you play or pass? You gonna play again? Okay. What answer do you have for us this time? Oh. Yeah. That's what you think, huh? Do we have a right answer? Stomach. There it is. Whoop. What do you think? We need another answer. Um. Yes. Yes. Let's see if that's a correct answer. Legs. Good work. Hey. Let's hope you haven't run out of ideas yet. Oh. That's a good answer. Oh, okay. Did anyone in the survey say this? Shoulders. Good oh. going. All right. We need another answer from you. Great answer. That's not the first time I've heard that answer. Uh, no uh, points. Uh, Where do bodybuilders have muscles that ordinary people don't? Good answer. That's good. Survey said, neck. It's Ooh. on the board. Nice. Two answers are left, just two. What uh -huh. could be easier? Nice. All right. Time to check the board. Heart. Ooh, it's another strike. Are you ready? I need an answer from you. Right. Good. All righty then. Is it on the board? Ouch, third strike. There's an opportunity to steal here. Now the other family only need to find one answer and they can take this round. Here's your chance. You can do it. Oh, nice. yeah. Yeah. I see where you're going with this. Survey says, head. You didn't find what we wanted. That's two in a row for y'all. Keep it up. So what did we miss this time? Number five. Back. What was the third answer? Chest. 
So, where are everybody's scores at? Hope you all can get... It's time for a face-off. Can I have a person from each team join me over here? This time, you've got six answers to find. Time to raise the stakes. We're doubling the points. We took a survey. 100 people. Name something that becomes more comfortable the longer you have it. You buzzed in first. That's a good answer. Interesting answer. Let's see what the survey says. Chair. You're on the board, but it's not the number one answer. All right, you're up. Name something that becomes more comfortable the longer you have it. Great answer. Are you sure about that? Our survey says... Spouse. Good try but it doesn't beat what's already up there. You can play or pass and force the other family to play. You want to step up to the plate again? All right, then. Put on your thinking cap. It's time for an answer. Good. Understood. Let's see if the board's got it. Car. If it's not on the board, you get a strike. You can do it. What do you think? Uh-huh. Oh, nice. Good. Okay. Let's see it. House. That's your second oh, strike right oh. there. Oof. Name something that becomes more comfortable the oh. longer you have it. Yeah. Okay, sure. Let's check the board. Bed. Oh, no. Strike three. Oh, oh. Yes. Our other family has a chance to steal. One answer will do it, and they can steal the round. If it's up there, you steal the points. If not, they go to the other family. Yes. Yes. Okie dokie. Let's check the board and see if it made it. Work! They couldn't do it. The points go to this family. Now it's time to see what you missed. What was hiding behind six? Couch. Answer number five. Pillow. What was the second highest answer? Clothes. What was the top answer? Shoes. Are you ready to see the scores? Let's reveal. One family may be zero for three, but I can feel a big turnaround coming just around the bend. So we're coming to the end of my YouTube video right now, so... Give a thumbs up button if you like the video so much. Click on that bell button to subscribe for more content. And if you saw the recent video interesting, share the comment right below the description so you can share some thoughts and feelings with everybody in the community and make them feel welcome. So I make a happy Corona 95. You all have a great day and peace out.